Hello everyone, welcome to Hunt Electronics. This is your friend Sakib and today I have come with a new technical topic that is capacitor colors and number coding technique or how to calculate the capacitor color code. In my previous session we have uh, seen about the different types of uh, capacitor and its classification. Okay, so today we are going to see how we can decode the color coding of the capacitor or a number of the capacitor. The first type here it is a large type of capacitor already we have seen in, in my last technical session these are the electrode type of the capacitor over here. So generally uh, when the capacitor of the large size uh, the value is written on the side of the capacitor. So in the figure you can see here uh, this is the one of the example that four, uh, 450 hold and 22 microfarad it is shown over here. So generally always uh, on a large capacitor the value of the capacitor is always mentioned into the microfarad and when we are talking about microfarad it is nothing but a it is 10 raised to minus 6 and uh, you can convert into the nanofarad that is 10 raised to minus 9 and or you can convert it into the picofarad that is a 10 raised to minus 12 over here the voltage rating on the capacitor indicates the maximum voltage that the capacitor can be handled so you can't give a uh, the maximum voltage uh, or above the threshold level which is defined on the capacitor over here for example if it is a, a 450 volt you can't give up to 500 volt over here otherwise it will get damaged the vac uh, represent the capacitor is designed only for ac ac circuit so some of you can see here it is uh, mentioned as a 450 if it is a 450 vac it it, uh, it says that it is uh, defined only for the ac circuits and the tolerance value indicates uh, indicates that the variation of the capacitance so if it is uh, it will be defined as over here in the another example you can see here it is written as a 1500 microfarad 16 hold with pwm so this indicates the tolerance of the capacitor so what this m indicates that we are going to see in the next slide over here so this is electrode type of the capacitor now the next uh, series is called as a two numerical value capacitor so these are the type of the ceramic capacitor okay so once again friend uh, if you have not uh, seen my uh, types of capacitor video please uh, learn about the types of the capacitor and then you can video so here you can see it is a two uh, numerical value capacitor over here this is ceramic type or it is also known as a disc type capacitor where only two values are present so you can see a 33 27 15 or 5R2 so you can see here if the notation on the capacitor has a two digits like 22M okay so we can see a 22M then it has a capacitance of 22 picofarad so always these use the value of picofarad uh, some capacitor have the letter uh, in the second position and a numerical value in the first and the last position over here you can see here it is 5R2 okay so it is pi r2 this indicates that it is a 5.2 picofarad 5.2 picofarad uh, in the place of r the letter like p m u are present then they uh, their unit represent the capacitor as suppose it is a 4 and 1 so it is 4.1 nanofarad if it is a represented as a 4 p1 so it it will be represented as 4.1 picofarad or it is represents uh, suppose it is uh, written as a p45 it is 0 0.45 picofarad and so on so this uh, it is a pico nano and micro like this so on so these are a two numerical value capacitor similar way you will find a three value numerical capacitors also you can see here 104 Two two three one zero three one zero one. Now, what this indicates? So, most of the ceramic capacitor have a three value printed on it. For example, one zero three, one zero four, one zero five, etc. And let's see how to read it. Suppose the value is uh, one zero three over here. I have taken this one zero three. So, first two digit indicates the numerical value, and uh, three indicates the number of zero to be added, or it is always measured with uh, raised to the power of three. Suppose it is 104, it will be 10 into 10 raised to 4 and the whatever answer you will get, it will be in the picofarad. Always it will be in the picofarad. Now see, similarly, if a special marking code ceramic like 105, so 105, so this is 10 plus 
five zero. So it will it will be somewhat a thousand thousand micro uh, picofarad over here. Or simply you can write one zero into ten raised to five. Will game same. So it can be converted into the thousand. So this picofarad you can easily convert it into the thousand nanofarad and thousand nanofarad is equal to one microfarad over here. So this is how you can calculate a three numerical value ceramic capacitor. Now the next over here in the menu of the capacitor you will find some alphabet numbers over there alphabetical M, N, A, B, C, D, E and what is indicates. So there are letters on a ceramic capacitor for example we will take same example 22 M. Now 22 indicates that is a 22 picofarad and what this M indicates so here I have given one table over here which uh, gives the example of a tolerance so here M indicates it is a plus minus 20% tolerance of the capacitor so it is giving the tolerance of the capacitor so 22 M is nothing but a 22 picofarad with plus minus 20 tolerance over here suppose it is 33 N if it is written here 33 N so 33 represent 33 picofarad with plus minus okay N indicates here so plus minus 30% tolerance over here and apart from here you can see some of the disk capacitor directly they have printed over here 100 picofarad with 1000 volt voltage is also given over here so there are different way how so this is the best way how you can so you should uh, have a good knowledge of this table now the next one it is a capacitor color code so in one of my video i have uh, uploaded a how to calculate a register color code in the similar way even the capacitor has got a color coding and it has got its own table over here so there are a four band and five band capacitors over here so first let's see how we can calculate a four band over here so in the example i have shown here the first band is always a first number of the capacitor second color is always a second number of the capacitor third color band is a number of zeros or a multiplier uh, multiplier band and fourth is always representing the percentage of it now for example below you can see the first band is orange so the orange here stands for a digit one that is three next is yellow that stands for four so it becomes 34 and a uh, third band which is a multiplier band that is white in color that should be a 0.1 so here it becomes th 3 4 okay that is 3.4 into okay 0 0.1 so after multiplying it is 3.4 plus minus and the last one is the tolerance that is red color over here so red color you can see the tolerance it has got a 0 0.25 percent picofarad 0 0.25 picofarad or you can say plus minus 2 percent tolerance so the value of this capacitor becomes 3.4 plus minus 0 0.25 picofarad so friends this is how we calculate a four band of a capacitor over here so there is one more example over here uh, calculate a four band color code for a ceramic capacitor and give the answer in the comment box so yes my friend so this is a table you can take a screenshot and uh, the first is yellow then brown red and the last one is the green you have to calculate and give this answer in the comment box uh, the first 10 uh, answers uh, please give the comment along with your mail id over here there will be an exciting prize for you people the next one is a five band color code capacitor over here so there is a different table for a five band over here now what it represents so similar to the four band the first two band always represent the number so you can see the first number and second number third represent the number of zeros to be added or the multiplier fourth is the tolerance percentage and the fifth band which represents the voltage so for the voltage you have got a different table over here so depending upon the type of capacitor the voltage always vary for example the last fifth band is a yellow color so i will take an example as a yellow color and it is of a type l so it will be 400 volts so you can see here the types i have given here j type it is a titanium capacitor k type it is a mica type of capacitor l type is a polyester type of the capacitor okay m type is electrolytic four band capacitor capacitor and is a electrolytic three band capacitor and so on so depending upon which type you have to uh, from that you will get the knowledge of a uh, voltage let's see one uh, one of the example of it so you can see here one example of over here the first band okay of uh, one of the capacitor here it is first band uh, it is yellow color so it is 4 
then second band is a violet that is 7 over here then the orange so it is a multiplier band or simply you can add the number of zero so it it is a thousand over here then white it is a plus minus 10 percent tolerance or multiply by 0 0.1 so it will be 4 uh, 47000 picofarad if we convert it will become 47 nanofarad and if we convert into the microfarad it will be 0 0.047 and the last one is a yellow color last one is the yellow color so in the uh, previous see we have seen here it, it, it is a l type over here so it is representing a 400 volt so here that's why here it is a 400 volt so it is 0 0.047 microfarad with 400 volt over here in the case now in the similar way there are two more examples which i have given over here you can take a screenshot and uh, please give the answer of this into the comment box uh, my dear friends so the first 10 answers uh, along uh, please comment with along with your mail id uh, so you will get an exciting gift for this so that's all my dear friend uh, please uh, for a more technical session like this please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel